source of attention in the play to make it sound even, even better. Uh, I think you have great technique to be able to handle a slow tempo. You know, and it's it's more difficult to play to play in Beethoven, not molto allegro or presto. Yeah, you create too much noise. To this language is so so complex, so modern, so dissonant. You have to let us absorb all these kicks and not rush. Yeah, most of the pianists play play fast. Even big artists play this sonata so fast. Uh, it's officially an echo. Yeah. It's, not, it's not pressed. Uh, I, I'm sure you have Russian teacher. He told me many things about this, uh, the background and story behind it. Is Prokofiev you wrote it during this. Very scary time, right? Uh, he more so told me the research is about. Uh, oh, please do. Yes. So he worked on those three uh, so-called war sonatas, pretty much same time, six, six seven, seven, eight. Yes. He finished six first, but uh, this was completed in 1942, I think, and Victor was the first performer. <coughs> anyway, it's it's very violent. It's scary. It's uh, extremely chromatic and. Uh, so you have to let us hear all these small intervals, right? not just play loud, bang on the piano, and, and play it uh, too noisy, OK? Uh, what is the main key of the sonata? Uh, here we go. C major. So it sounds like. <laughs> Mendelssohn will write the main theme. But it's B flat major. We don't have any B flat major. I hear B flat major only here. In the very end. Yeah, that's the complete B flat major chord. And by the way, we don't hear it clearly if, if it's played like this. But I mean, you really have to try to deliver B flat major, which is hard and the lower uh, registers. So I may try to convince you to play a little bit slower, less fortissimo, and you have to strategize your dynamic. It always says where it starts, where it goes. Yeah. Sometimes you reach fortissimo too soon and just remain loud, and it doesn't go anywhere. Right? So 6-8 Allegro, how fast do you think? Of course, it depends on the, your personal interpretation, but you play presto. It's easy. Listen for space between notes. Ta -ta 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 -ta. Let us observe the sound, right? Try. Okay, and uh, you play between legato and non legato. It shall be extremely precise. The touch you play. You play. Make sure it, it's not like. Some, sometimes connected to it has to be absolutely the same. Yeah. Try. Okay. Try to try to lock your wrists and use your fingertips only. But it's more about. Better. Okay. Now, many pianists start this sonata like this. Oh, hello, everyone. Yeah. What is the main dynamic mezzo piano? Yeah? It's very soft compared to. And that's the first accent. Definitely not B flat major, the main key of the sonata, but at least it's a first B flat, right? And then, timpani like this, this part. Let this B flat survive and sustain, right?
this, where it says poco a poco crescente. We have to arrive to this in here. Yeah? So when Prokofiev writes, first this one, To me, the, the B flat goes to here. What is between is, is a little bridge. Yes? So don't play it so loud. It's not, you know, it's not the melody. It, it's a color. Okay? B flat, B natural. Thank you. 
That's my own reason. Uh, you can play whatever, but uh, I think you think you, we, ha we have to hear and we have to, therefore you have to emphasize this interval. But we will hear it anyway. But what is missing is how E flat does change according to this and this. So E flat has to be. try to avoid any sentimental feelings, push and pull, too much rubato to my taste. What the length in mind is? Trasivo e Valente. Valente. Sorrowful. Very sad and sorrowful. Okay? Uh, it's not a picture of, uh, it's not a total release here today. You can enjoy, you know, the view, but it's, it's still scary. Yeah. It's still you have to find, uh, so try, try to avoid any sentimental expressions. I mean, be very subdued. Very important. That's how typically we will play because the value of the note, the last one is long, but he wants the note on the first note. It's Is this too important? No, no Chopin. <laughs> I'd like to try maybe. And not like on this way, very, very precise touch. What is the second finger doing? Like too much tension in your hand. Relax. Just, just be very. The goal is to have the best control over the sound. You can come back. 
back to your forehead, but there is no space for, for a relaxed wrist. Like you don't play it like this. You play it extremely precise. simplicity in your playing. Still search for uh, those small slurs tell you exactly how you would phrase. Uh, you have a tendency. You don't connect. That ends. the second okay this is a bit light uh, it shouldn't be like ta 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 depending on your fingering it, you have to play it extremely even Still extremely chromatic. The most important, what you build build up here is the tension between those small intervals that generate this extreme sorrowful move. Okay, so no Chopin. Let's move on to the. I really like it. Very dry, no pedal. Okay, uh, it doesn't look nice if you if I see you so big all of a sudden. <laughs> so perhaps no ritenuto is allowed in the You try to play extremely soft, but it, it helps. Your piano is brighter than mine. It's 
Yes. You can play by support deck and still be so friendly. Depends what you need, what color and, and uh, what kind of, how many layers you need to generate. Poco, poco, what? Accelerato. And crescendo, yes? Where does it end? Which, which, which dynamic range you have to reach? Fortissima, uh, where is it? Listen 
noise, but just very clear, no noise. Don't cut the string. Can you start over? That's actually the beginning of uh, recap section. That's where we arrive to recap. Everything was so loud here. And uh, 
the way you jump on that C. My personal recommendation, uh, psychologically, many of us jump from last note to the first top note, which of course is a big distance here. You leave that C there, yeah, and play C at the beginning. But mentally, don't try to connect and jump. That's very difficult, right? So, because your goal to play it without delay. If you if you postpone that top note, it means you have some problem being there on time. Oh, see, I did. So try to be on time, and then don't speed up here. Super difficult. Practice slowly, gradually increase, but stay dry and again, listen to clarity. Don't create too many notes. Try to be very uh, fair with yourself, okay, in your, your pitch. Uh, very difficult passage, just make sure we hear the right notes, okay. Because he already sounds like computer are speaking. <laughs> or machines or something, right? <laughs> Oh, 
express anything. I mean, of course, you express an idea, but, but it's not like. I'll make you share this. By the way, can you play right hand same as perfect as two? Here we're played with two hands. Then we have to deal with this one. why you don't play it but if you, even if you play with one hand uh, it's not same it, it, it's not connected it must be emptied you pass it to the so change the beat single C B B
We'll do it together then. So if I play all notes, it's yes. It, it's very soft. It dies away very quickly. But before you switch, you have to get all the music. Yeah, because you take off. So try. It's, it, it's very hard, but in the recording, for sure, you have to think about such small things, maybe which are not projected in the whole, but for the record, you might will definitely catch such small nuances. And then let me hear this first. this one other for many years um, the break between <laughs> this Prokofiev language uh, when you re return after a few years of not playing this sonata you remember all motives but it, it's gone you have to start over it, it's quickly come back to your muscles and memory but <laughs> something that you learn at the age of how old are you now? Uh, 15 yeah like traditional Brahms, Chopin, Mendelssohn, Schumann it stays in your memory but this at home music is so tricky, you have to play it regularly or work, <laughs> start over each time. So try, it's very, it's very important. What will be it? Oh, you can. You can. And then get on the... Uh -huh. 
soft pedal may works to make it softer, but to if you play with fingertips and scratch it, kind of scratch it, maybe we can recognize it differently if you want. All right, but that that's the idea. So no rush to my dictate. Don't be like most of us. <laughs> be clear with all ideas. That's that's the beauty of this. All right. Thank you. We're done.